Hi, I'm Stephanie Sinclair. If you're undecided about the bill to retire New York's carriage horses, please consider this. Last year, I came to New York City as a tourist and witnessed a horse-drawn carriage accident that left a panic-stricken horse writhing on the ground. I grew up with horses, and I tried to help, but the driver was more concerned with the damage to his carriage. He called me a bitch and a whore. I have since learned that hate speech is a hallmark of Manhattan's horse-drawn carriage drivers. How did a driver respond to a mixed-race lesbian couple concerned about his horse in 2012? Yeah, 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 a little fucking date convention. Big date convention here. How did the owner of the city's biggest stable respond to a Latina worried about his horse? Are you barren? Are you childless? Lonely? This one might have six or seven kids because, you know, what can I tell you? And last year, when a young man questioned a driver about leaving his horse tied to a lamppost, this was the response. Are you allowed to tie the horse? Hey! I'm Thank not you. into guys, man. I don't fuck with guys. Oh, oh you have one of those packets. Should a city known for tolerance defend a tiny trade that uses such hate speech? Please urge your city council member to vote for the bill retiring the horses. Let's make New York streets safer, cleaner, more humane, and less hateful.